Hello everyone, welcome to my channel ESP.NET Core and today I am going to show you the next video or you can say the last video tutorial of your fast food uh, fast food ordering system. So if you go for the admin account in the orders, then here you can say that uh, admin can check the order details. But here you can say that admin have some update options if you have some mistakes or some order detail mistakes. So uh, admin also some perform the start processing and here we have uh, not found error message on the uh, start processing so here we have in process uh, mode so just uh, create a in process action method and update the header status according to the update uh, status message so here we have in process action method where we have order detail view model and by using the order detail view model just get the order header okay after order header you have to change this order status and order status that is status status in process and after that uh, contest change and your button uh, text will be uh, you can say that changed and uh, you can uh, you can uh, again you have to run your project and order status update in the process of in process after the in process when we click on the uh, after in process then you can say that pro a product will be shipped or you can say that the product in the transient mode so just uh, click on the approved order in the admin account and check the details and here we have start processing just click on the start processing here we have the shipped order again when we click on the shipped order according to the details id then you can say that your order will be shipped according to the uh, also change the order status uh, with the you can say that uh, order status uh, will status in process to change status uh, shipped order status uh, is that shipped according to the vm dot order header id so uh, just um, again redirect that page according to the id property of the order header so here we have so you can say that then the next process is in process and uh, add a new method that is shipped and according to the shipped your order header detail will be changed and order status will be changed in the form of order uh, order shipped So here we have I action method and here we have okay so these are the order details dot CSHTML file where a user is in role that is admin and the manager in the position then you can say that mm, lots of uh, code will be visible and uh, if you are in the customer role then lots of code will be hide okay so here we have in process mode when we click on the submit button then you can say that the order status that is the status in process so when we click on the submit button the action will be called on the shipped so here we have order details and the order status so the next method is to write in the code that that is for the shipped <coughs> so here we have a shipped method you can do and here we have order detail view model according to the order detail view model just get the order header by their id property so here we have x tends to x dot id equals to vm dot order header dot id after that change the status in the form of the status shipped and also the temp data will be called order status updated saved and in this video tutorial just i'm going to do for the toaster alert and the sweet alert So here we have fast food and just click on the CMS button and just go on the order button and just go for the approved 
and here we have some detail section method and here we have just shipped order just click on the shipped order and you can say that order detail will be called according to their order details okay so here we have the status will be changed in the cancelled order so first of all redirect that page from here and change the order from the orders in the controller section okay in, in the last section of the shift action method you can see that here we have order instead of order you can take uh, orders Okay, so everything is right now you can do uh, it yourself and go for every steps and uh, if you uh, if you want to ask anything then please comment me and don't forget please subscribe my channel and also press the bell icon if you get the latest notifications about that project and ASP.NET Core new features so uh, Wait, uh, wait for the results and uh, this is the last video tutorial of ASP.NET Core Fast Food Project System. So wait for the result and uh, check all these things which is related to this project. Thank you very much.